Let's talk about data budgets in 2025. Now, it's, it's an important question for data vendors, right? This is, a, this is the macro signal that determines uh, the course of our revenues. And uh, for other you know, data, vendor, data vendors out there, I have a message for you. It's going to be OK. All you data buyers, I have a message for you. We know what you're up to. Um, but more specific, actually not specifically, just more generally, we were so accustomed post-COVID to global asset prices rising, investors having more money and more money to spend to accumulate alpha, that when that stopped, when the Federal Reserve started raising interest rates, we were not, as an industry, we're not prepared. And so then it started to raise internal questions like, oh, is, is our product not good? Do we miss our uh, ICP? And we started asking the wrong questions, where really what was happening was that as global asset prices went down, investment managers who charge a fee on assets, their revenue went down, which meant that their budgets got squeezed. This year, asset prices are largely up. Revenues are largely up for investment managers, which means data budgets are going to be OK. So you can try and tell me your data budget got cut, and I know you're not telling me the truth.